I mean, too. you remember, I mean, so people are using some some nicotine type gums and, and mm -hmm. things of that nature, but that's more for cognition. Yep. The nicotinic receptors in the brain. So th there, that nicotine releases more acetylcholine mm -hmm. from the presynaptic synapse, and then that acetylcholine goes into either acetylcholine receptors or nicotinic receptors, and that's what creates, you know, kind of that more vigilance type mm -hmm. state, um, similar to caffeine in in, in that state of awareness. Yeah. Does it also right? cause vasoconstriction as but well? That's everything, right? So vasoconstriction. So people are like, you know, it relaxes me. I, I'm always confused. And there's something to it. But physiologically, it doesn't relax you. Your heart mm -hmm. rate goes up. Your blood pressure goes up. How is nicotine relaxing you? Yeah, I can't figure that one out. I can't square that <laughs> circle either, right? There, I've, there, I've dabbled a time or two. Yeah, but... I mean, well, prior military, right? Yeah. It's just, it's you're in that situation, right? Less so pronounced now, but you know, they, that, now they have non-tobacco pouch dips. I can't yep. think of the name of it. Zin. I, Zin. Zin. Yeah, I know uh, Sean Ryan's, you know, promoting one. Oh, I'll rip it through and, those. Yeah. yeah, and I'm like, <laughs> you know, God bless. Yeah, do you think, makes, but. It makes you feel a little anxious. And one benefit I have used it during long cardio sessions, which I do once a year. Um, they, it. It seems to make my runs go better, and I, okay. I can't really explain why. Maybe it, the, the, I guess, dopamine release that I do get from that makes tamps down the pain of cardio. Right. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Who knows? I, yeah. I, you know, it's the, the physio. That's one we have to throw to Hubert.